need here is that uh, child protection issues are not sufficiently addressed to. Like there is more focus on, on child rights, but still it's not enough. And especially the, the point of child protection needs to be addressed more severely. And that's why we organized this conference. Child protection policies also in all the countries in the region. But there has been no integration between child protection policy and disaster management policy. This regional meeting is conducted by TDH Germany uh, together with Siwish. And we invited um, the partners that we were engaged in in the different disaster situations. And TDH Germany in South Asia has partners in India, Pakistan and in Nepal. So here we are to share our experiences and to learn from each other. So for us this is a mutual learning exercise. And we learn so that we become better actors, we become better workers in the interest of the child rights. Concern of the um, uh, about 700 plus million children issues in this area. Actually this area itself is the uh, very much uh, vulnerable for the disaster so that we have to understand it first of all what are the policies um, are mentioned and whether it is properly implementing or not, where is the gap. So here we came to meet together. Uh, we have come from Pakistan, almost four organizations uh, from Pakistan to participate in this event. The purpose is to uh, learn the best practices from each other. They inaugurated the program. There was a keynote address from a member from the, uh, from the Planning Commission of Nepal. And there was director of uh, the Department of Women and Child Development uh, and somebody from the Social Welfare Deve Department as well. So they have already extended support uh, to this kind of a meeting. It's very touchy to everybody. And this is from Nepal. These kids are struggling to go to school. And uh, through the uh, geography and... Uh... First of all, whole day, we were listening to each other. We had experts from Kathmandu, experts from India and also from Pakistan who spoke about uh, the situations there in a general way. Then we had you know, uh, civil society representatives who were actually practically involved in the disaster situations and were supporting uh, children's uh, rights and were working towards restoring the rights of the children. They shared their experiences in different contexts. Some shared experiences in the context of flood, some shared it in the context of earthquake, some others shared it in the context of drought and so on. On the basis of which we are trying to identify the gaps by are doing a group discussion. Uh, we are trying to identify three things, as I said already, what has been done already, and what is, uh, has been positive, what has been the deficit. We are searching always the answers, and this is part of our search and part of our, our commitment to children's rights. This is the, uh, very good to listen and it was very interactive session also, like participants were discussing a group, you know, what are the gaps, what challenges are there, what needs to be done, what are the children issues, emerging issues are there. So those issues we discuss. If you look at the, the problems just concerning child rights in these countries, they're very similar. So that's why the solutions or like the suggestions how to fill the gaps that are still exist, existing will be also quite similar, despite the different situations that we have. So I think we can find a, a common understanding of what, what needs to be done in future disasters respecting child rights for all these three different countries. We have had this workshop for the last three days and there's also been a lot of debate on child safety mechanisms and child protection. 
how communities can be involved, how communities should be involved in keeping children safe and how we can have vigilant groups within the community to keep children safe in disaster situations. And also last at the end we have the Kathmandu Declaration on Child Rights and Disaster Situation which is very good document uh, to take forward uh, on child protection issues and disaster situation. Kathmandu Declaration, this is somehow a guideline uh, for all of us who are coming from three countries. India will go back and work with its own government and other agencies. Participants from Pakistan will also go back and uh, work with their agencies. We have a police officer from Pakistan, from Karachi here, participating in this meeting. So, uh, since we are talking about child protection, I am sure he is going to take back a big agenda for him to work on with his government. Me is the, the closing session chairperson, so you people invite me, that's my pleasure in front of you. हमरों समिति ये बाल मालिक का कुछ क्षेत्र में काम करने समिति पनी हो ये बाल इन में जो ना हमरों 2040 को बाल मालिक का संबंधी इन था तो इसमें संसदन को पनी कुरा उठाया था रतियों संसदन होता है कि ये स्ताप प्रावधान हर पनी लिया उन्हें परसा कि जब कुने किसी को डिजास्टर होने जाते इस बात अपीड़ित होने कून बार को बड़ी चा रत्तियों से संरचित का सरी गढ़ने राज्य द्वारा तेज कारण मुआ अपनों दायित्व समझें चुए इस बिसाय मामला है थैंक यू